In today's education news, leading head teacher calls for a 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. school day to break pupils' smartphone addictions. Yeah, a leading head teacher wants to introduce a 12-hour day to break pupils' phone addictions and improve behaviour. What make it clear, I've got absolutely nothing against this head teacher, and I actually think his intentions are right here. He's talking about how that time can be spent taking part in extracurricular activities such as sport, cookery, drama, which I think is crucial and I think is really important. I, I've taught numerous times about how much sport my kids play. Most evenings they'll be doing some sort of sport and I know I'm in a privileged position where my I can I can afford for my children to do all of that. It's just a couple of things I need to ask and question. First of all, from a teacher's perspective, most teachers will be in class with their students from half eight till half three, yet will still be working 12 plus hour days every single day because of all the admin, all of the workload. So if you're then going to extend the time ch children are in class with the teacher, how does that work? Now, we also said his staff are on board with this, which may well be the case, but I can also imagine that in that staff meeting after the staff meeting, you know, where everyone gets in someone's classroom to discuss what's gone on, there's a lot of questions being asked. Now, it seems the motivation behind this decision is to try and get children off their phones. Now, we know the mobile phones issue is, is massive. As teachers, we see it. We know the detrimental impact giving these devices to young children without monitoring without education can lead to so many problems but why is it whenever there is some sort of issue within our society it is just now expected that teachers have to be the answer take on that responsibility and solve it without any further help or funding because that sort of thing leads to more teachers being burnt out and leaving with things like this i find and again, I'm open to discussion around this, that the vast majority, most if not all of the issues around smartphone use and students tends to happen outside of school hours. This whole thing of the government seeing it as a win to introduce a mobile phone ban when pretty much every school had already got a mobile phone ban, but teachers and schools are having to spend so much of their time dealing with issues around students using devices at home outside of school. So at what point are we going to have a discussion about parents taking responsibility for their child's phone use? I regularly talk on my training and share lots of ideas to teachers who can then share it onto parents about how to use things like screen time limits, how to monitor, how to make sure students get a decent screen time balance with their devices. And I'm planning on making videos on my channels to also help with that. Why is it that these sort of issues always come back on being school's responsibility? I'm also not so sure whether I want my children in school from seven till seven for 12 hours. I think they need a bit of a break, need a bit of downtime, to be honest. But again, I know that comes from a privileged position of my children being able to come home to a, a safe environment, have us as parents present to be with them. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I welcome your thoughts with this. I, I, I'm, I'm a bit conflicted because the intention is right. I think children getting more opportunities with sport, drama, creative arts, absolutely. I don't know how well that's going to work with the current funding crisis, the current workload issues within education. Plus, I'm just not so keen on teachers and schools now having to take on the responsibility and solve this issue when all of these issues happen outside of school.